Hi friends, welcome to M3 Design Tutorials. This is Murugesh. Today I'm going to show you how to make a uh, piston in a Creo Parametric 2.0. So first of all, if you like this video, please please subscribe my channel. So let's start the work. Go to New and type the name you want. Okay, now select the front plane. Click on Sketch and click on Sketch View. Take a line tool. Now make a line here. here is the measurement of 35 mm okay now take a circle tool and make a circle from here not in the center and give the measurement as 378 at the diameter okay now drag this circle below take a center line and make a center line at the end of the line delete segment tool and delete these other segments okay now take line tool and start from here make three grooves of the piston rings okay now type here 2 okay and type here um, 2.5 Okay, now scroll click on this and type here 3, yes, not 3, okay, type here 2, and type here 2 also, yes. Now take a normal tool and click on this line and this line and scroll click and type 40. Okay. Now take a line tool and join these lines and here also. Okay. Now take a center line and make a center line from here. Okay. Sorry. Uh, we have to delete this line so right click and click on edit definition uh, delete segment tool and delete this and click on ok yes now take a revolve and click on this axis yes and ok now select uh, front plane sorry front view we have to make a, a hole for the gudgeon pin now so uh, enable the plane and select this plane and click on sketch now click on sketch view take a circle tool and make a circle from here I'm not taking all the dimension perfectly so now type here 18 you can take references for perfect placement of hole so now click on ok go to extrude now select remove material and select the extrude both side from here and ok yes now we have to remove the material from some places ok now select this plane and click on sketch and sketch view yes now take references ok take references and select this also this and this ok sorry we have to add uh, one more reference yes Select this curve 
okay now again make a line from here sorry we have to add one more reference this middle line okay now take a line tool and draw line from here yes and from here and from here yes now okay now select this distance as 6 and now take a normal tool select this line and this middle line and scroll click now type here 12 okay now again do this for this line and this now scroll click and 12 yes okay now sorry right click on and uh, click on edit definition and join this uh, area extend this line little bit and join this yes okay now go to extrude go to extrude and remove material and again remove material from both sides and extend okay now take a mirror and select this middle plane and okay yes now take a round tool and select these lines 2.5 this this and sorry not this delete this set from here sorry delete this set from here okay and select this okay again do the other side this 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 line and this line okay now we have to remove more material from below okay now mm, select this middle plane okay now sketch and sketch view yes now select the line tool okay now make line from here first of all take a reference this line this middle line this line and this line yes now take a line tool again and make line from here okay click on escape uh, sorry press escape now take a arc tool and make arc like this okay now scroll click on this arc and type 178 okay now select this both lines make a center line from here first select this both lines click on mirror and okay yes now fillet and select this both lines okay now it's perfect okay now take a line tool and extend and complete the shape and okay 
now go to extrude and extrude the material remove material and extrude from both side click on ok now we have to remove the material for uh, connecting rod so now mm, click on sketch and select this plane bottom plane ok now uh, select the bottom view ok now take a concentric circle tool bottom view and select concentric circle tool ok and make a circle from here put the value of 60 yes now take a line tool and make line from here ok as a measurement of um, 58 sorry 56 56 yes now take a mirror tool and select the sorry we have to make the center line first so make a center line take a mirror tool and make a copy of this by mirror tool okay yes now take this measurement as 58 not 56 58 and okay sorry first of all take a delete segment tool and delete this areas yes okay now go to extrude uh, remove material remove the material okay and extend as the measurement of 35 mm yes 35 okay now the piston is ready so thank you for watching please 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 subscribe my channel if you like the video and if you want to ask me anything comment on my video goodbye have a nice day